What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Greg. Go crazy. Go crazy. Yes. We back with some new gameplay. Now, as y'all can see by the title, we in the stage with it today. Yes. I said it. We in the stage. The ante up. Did y'all hit that subscribe button yet? Y'all hit the subscribe button and turn on the post notifications. Y'all need to do that now. But as I was saying, yes, we are in the stage with it today. Now, people who might not know the stage is where the best of the best come play and it's where you put your vc on the line you lose your pockets losing you're losing with your pockets too i mean it's simple as that so you can't be messing around here so this is where the best of the best play and the way this game is majority what you're gonna see is these scoring machines everywhere that's all you gonna see. So if you're playing the same, everybody's a demigod build, it's gonna be hard to win games. I know it's gonna be crazy out here, but today I'm gonna give y'all a few tips on how to win some stage games. Number one key is, you really can't mess up. That That's really the number one key. You really can't mess up. You can't do nothing stupid, really. You do one stupid mistake that could cost you literally the entire game. One mistake in the stage can cost you the entire game. One defensive mistake, one turnover, one offensive mistake, one stupid shot, anything. That can cost you in the stage, literally. That's one thing. Don't try to mess up in the stage. Don't shoot no stupid shot. Like this. This is what not to do. Don't do that because that can cost them the game. Like it did. Like watch this. Watch later on. They mess up. Look, we're going to capitalize on this. You see me cooking up ice on and that's another thing another tip in the stage you going to look step back green bean hold up my bad he, he wasn't guarding me my bad another thing is you need to have rotations and you need to have like certain stuff set up you need to know what y'all gonna do in the stage who guarding who who can guard the best iso play who gonna guard the best shots in the corner that's all you need to know really and if you can figure those out and come up with some defensive sets like, we got a defensive set. Like, if dude just, like, trying to shoot at the top of the key, one person to run up and the other dude to go straight to the corner so the corner won't be wide open. Like, look at him. That was a – they had bad defense right there. I just didn't shoot that because you got to try to score every possession in the stage like that. That's a good pass right there. It's three to nine. They messed up. We got it right back. Just like that. I mean, it's as simple as that. But if you not ready for the stage, do not come – I'm just trying to test nothing out. No, y'all got to, you got to know what you're doing in here. Because if you don't, it's over with. But as you can see right now, the score is five to nine. They done messed up a few times, took a stupid shot, and not playing defense, as you can see. No defense equals the other team probably, probably is going to get a bucket. Now, you really don't want that in the stage. Because look, look, that's just stupid. That shouldn't have got that point. That's a bad line. They need to patch contact dunks a little bit more. Just a little bit. Not all the way. A little bit. But I'm telling you, one turnover can cost you everything. And it says now we switching. We switching. Turn. We switching taking turns on who going to ISO. Because it throws off everybody. Now look, you see him, he get the little crazy spin, get the little dunk. Some slight. 714. I mean. Burger Boy ain't doing nothing right now. Uh, that's all I'm gonna say. Burger Boy ain't doing nothing. Ain't it look get his little rim run dunk? Because no matter what it is, if you can't get no three off and y'all down, just try to score whatever you can. But you gotta try to get some defensive stops, some key stops to really come back. Like right now, it's gonna be very hard for them to come back. Cause we are in a tough situation. We really can't miss. We missed that could sell the game. Like look at him. Hey, it's 16 to 9. Right now, they probably not gonna win this game. Now look, Burger Boy trying to ISO. He trying to do whatever he can. He really not like that. Look, he just speed boost glitching. Look, he get the little easy dunk because we let him take it. We like, if you can give up a two rather than a three, let them take that two every single time. Just let them have it. I mean, they get a two, you get a two right back. It's a even deficit, except for you're up already. Like, look at that. Look, he not guarding me. Look, has he? Hey, see me going baseline, getting a little baseline dunk on him. Look, look, look what I tell you. What I say? They get a two, we get a two. And we still have the advantage. They done already messed up too many times. Look at him. And that's another thing. Never jump in the stage. Just run. Don't jump. 
even though that was on his part that time. But if you win the stage, do not jump. No matter how much time is left on the clock. If you think they're going to shoot it, just run towards them. Do not jump. Because if you jump and they don't shoot it, that's on you. And they're probably going to get an open three. Like that. Like, he got a, like, stupid shot, whatever he shot. But anyway, it's 20 to 14. Now, look. See, look. He learned from his mistakes. He didn't jump. Because they know they're trying to get a three. That we know they're trying to get a three. So we're watching this three as heavily as we can. But they still get off. But thankfully, he missed. And that's ball game for him. Now, you see me. I could have shot that, but nah, I'm waiting for him. I'm icing him. I said, nah, we need to go for this smart, easy two. But you see him. He shoot a white. And I don't know how it go in. But it manages to go in. Now, y'all hit the subscribe button yet. And turn on them post notifications. There's something wrong. That's all I know. Something is wrong with y'all if y'all ain't hit that button yet. Now you see me with the look. Bye bye. Now look, we're gonna go on to the next gameplay. And they spun the block. They thought it was a fluke. That's what I like to see. When you think it's a fluke, spin that block. Spin it. Come on back. Look, I'm getting a little anchor break. You think you're doing something now. Stay spin that block if you think it's a fluke. I don't got no time. I don't got no mind playing you again. But as you can see. He run runs and they try to bail him out. But did it work? No, it didn't. Now look at them. They watching the three heavily. They're going to try to make us force a two. And whatever you can do to score to start off the game is what's best. Now look, they leave the paint open. My boy Michael get the little easy dunk. Now I'm two to zip. We have the advantage. All we have to do is stop them from hitting a three. Cut that three point line off and force them to get a two. And they miss and y'all come down and score. That could possibly determine the game. Now look, he got a little stupid layup that he shouldn't have hit in our faces, but it's alright. Cause my boy Michael, he coming down the court trying to ISO. You see him, you see him hitting with the heads. You know, look, he hit my boy Jay back door. Hey, four to two. They ain't watching the back door slip. You need to watch those too, cause those back door slips could cause the game to one alley you. Now the crazy thing is, I like how the alley oops are not. No, I'm not gonna say that. Cause they are still a little overpowered to a certain extent. Ooh, Green Bay, we shouldn't let up that three. Ali Uso are still overpowered to a certain extent, but they're not as overpowered as it was on current gen. Cause you can get an Ali U contact dunk on this game, and that'll change your whole animation on it. But in current gen, they just dunking it on you, and you can't do nothing about it. No current, no contact dunks, no nut. You see my boy, he shoot a white. I don't know how he shot a white, but hey man, it is what it is. I don't even know why he shot the mid-range in the first place. But we have the advantage right now. The score is 6-2-5. Now, all they got to do is score so they can try to have the advantage. Now, look, Burger Boy, Green Bean, hitting that mid-range. Oh, he think he got that burner on him. See, now we got to play for real on him. Look, he almost got the steal right there. I'm not even going to lie. He almost got the steal. My boy Michael hit my boy Jake in the paint. Look, we got the advantage. We're playing back and forth. And right now, we kind of have the advantage. So all we have to do is get one defensive stop on him. We get one stop on him, it might be it. Now you see dude, he hit me with the cradle dunk in the paint. I didn't think he was gonna take that. Now it's nine, two, eight. We need to score a three or something. We just need to try to get something open. Now look, I'm not shooting that because I hear my boy Michael, he tries to go for that steal. That steal is also deadly too. Now go me, green bean. Come on now, my bad for that. Green bean. Yeah, he need to step up. I don't know what's wrong. He must he must not have got the memo. See, look, now we had the advantage on him. Because he's going to get the little bail contact dunk like everybody else gets. It happens. Hey, it happens to the best of us. Now, you see me. I'm coming down. I'm getting my dunk right back, too. What's good? Yeah. 11-13. He need to step up. That's what he need. He need to step up and help his team out. Now, you see me trying to cook him. He trying to cook me. My bad. He trying to cook me. But that ain't working. Now his teammate doing that weak curry slide. Now look, this how you gotta play defense on look. That's the advantage, and that's the game. That's game right there. All we gotta do is score right here. Now am I gonna take that? I should have took that. No, but you have to find the better man for the better shot. Now look, he getting that dunk on him. 11 to 15. You also have to be patient in the stage. If you rush and you are not patient, you will lose. Look at him. Trying to rush to get a three. See what happened? Got to still hit my boy Jake Green Bean. Look, told you. Those two possessions caused them the game. Just like that. We turned it into a dunk 
and the three. Now, what can they do? A break. That's all they can do. It's over with now. Those three plays turn lost them the game. See my boy Jake coming down with a little easy dunk. 11 20. Ball in. Those three plays right there caused them the game in the stage. That's all it takes. Now look at dude. Now do we think I care if I give him a rim run? No. Then they throw another turnover. Just like that. It is 11 to 20. And just like that, he hit me and they make me go out of bounds with that pass. But it's all right though. He hit a pull up, green bean, you know. They get that every once in a while. And that fa them fans are overpowered. They need to pass that too. But we'll save that for another day. But as you can see right now, I'm going to the paint, trying to get the little easy dunk. And just like that, it's ball game. Now, if y'all hit that subscribe button yet, I don't know what to tell you. But that's about it though. But those are my tips on how to win in the stage. Now, hit them with the little bye bye wave you did. That's a classic wave. Gotta keep that on you. Now, yeah, if y'all don't hit that like, subscribe button for me, we ain't good. But I'm out. I'll catch y'all later.